his roots. We'll show you how only on News 36 Nightcast at 10. This year's Aquafest is now officially underway. As we told you earlier, the streets of downtown Austin have come alive with the sun. Video and rumors and bad mother goose. Just looking at a few of the things that you can look forward to at this year's Aquafest. All going on tonight. In the on Austin's auditorium shores. Good evening. The big summer music festival is finally here. Aquafest. It will run for eight days over the next couple of weekends and will feature more than 70 acts and entertainers. Tonight is the first night of what organizers hope will be a new and improved Aquafest. In the past couple of years, the attendance has dropped and the event has lost money. News 36's Lisa Glass joins us now live from Aquafest to tell us what they're doing differently this year in hopes of spicing things up. Lisa? Well, Sally, things might not look that spicy right now. The stage behind us is kind of slow. The band are taking a break right now, so not much going on at this stage. But one thing that organizers are doing is focusing more on Texas and local talent this year. They're also going for a more family-oriented atmosphere, and they're even giving away free passes to certain local nightclubs for those post-festival partiers. <laughs> The latest edition of Aqua Festival has a traditional kickoff, a massive parade around auditorium shores, leading to this. Continuous musical mastery that takes up three different stages, and the focus on Texas talent seems defined with festival goers. I like it. I've heard of it before, I haven't had a chance to attend for, and have not had a bad reputation in the past, but I like to change the low lack and more Texas fans, rather than drawing big name losers from out of town. True, there are some changes this year. I mean, from the time you walk into the front gate, uh, look at the stages and see the way the car was laid out, just the whole thing is more user friendly. It's, uh, it's certainly more affordable, got more family things. Yes, even the miniature fest goers now have their own stage agenda, but some parents aren't so excited. I think there could be a little bit more, uh, a little bit more going on. I think I did more. Uh, glad we had Kipper pins to get free. <laughs> But even those who have pay are forking out less money this year, and with them add attractions, including free lottery tit giveaways, organizers hope the track into Aquafest will gain momentum. Tonight the crowds are pretty slim, but if you are planning to come out to Aquafest at any point, your best bet is to go where the Capital Metro shuttle service because.